Tuesday Panthers. I'm your host, Chloe. And I'm Maddie. Yesterday, boys soccer took the field at Bossier and girls soccer played at West Monroe. The boys fell last night, but we'll take the field again on Friday in the playoffs. Best of luck, guys. Girls soccer came up with a big win over West Monroe. The score was 4-0 over the Lady Rebels to win the Parish Cup for the first time in school history. Two goals were scored by Layla Crawley, one by Sydney Ham, and a header by Isabella Briscato. Two assists from Sydney Ham and one from Jira Chance. Way to go, Lady Panthers. Tonight, JV boys and varsity basketball teams play Bastrop here at home. The tip-off is set for 5 p.m. Students get in free tonight, and it is also the boys' senior night. It is the last regular season home game, so let's show up and show out tonight. How do you feel getting into your first game back to your senior season? Oh, I'm excited to get back on the court with my teammates and actually get to play one of, one of the sports that I love my senior year. What are your expectations of the game tonight? I feel like we should end the night with a dog. Yeah. How do you feel about reaching 1,000 points? Uh, it feels great because this is something that I've dreamed about for a while, and you know I'm just thankful for my teammates and coaches that have helped me get there. And how do you feel about the game tonight? I'm excited and I'm ready to get a win. Tonight. Also in sports this week, softball and baseball begin spring play in scrimmages. JV and varsity girls softball plays at West Washita on Thursday at 5, and baseball plays at OCS in a scrimmage here at home on Saturday at 1. Indoor track also travels to Baton Rouge this Saturday to compete at LSU. Best of luck and safe travels to all our Panther athletes. National Art Society members, it's time to begin work on your spring service project. Report to Ms. Reitzel to get started. Hours must be complete by February 2nd. The awards breakfast is to be announced. Calling all with sketching and drawing talent. Prove your talent by creating five non-assisted original drawings and turn them into Ms. Reitzel by February 16th to be considered for talented art. Only graphite pencils and color. See Ms. Reitzel for further details. Let's check in with what to expect with today's weather. Howdy Panther fans, I'm meteorologist Dylan Downs. With temperatures this morning sitting at about the mid-40s with highs expecting to get up to 73. It'd be a perfect day to get out in. One second, Panthers fans. We have breaking news coming in from the Chance Crew. Breaking news, Panther fans. Update on the diagram. You cannot go through this area. You must go all the way around and turn. Panthers, make sure if you're in a back parking spot, you have to pull forward. When we lose all of these parking spots, the people who park here will need to park in those parking spots, pull all the way forward to make it the most convenient and efficient as possible. This was your breaking news. Thank you. Students, don't forget about FCS on Thursday. Students gather for fellowship at 720 in the library. Hope to see you there. Student Council is selling Valentine Graham. They will go on sale next Monday during the morning. They're $2 a piece, and the recipient will receive a donut on Valentine's Day. Give those orders in, Panthers. Also coming up soon is a school-wide Coca-Cola fundraiser. Sales begin next Monday on the 5th. Students are encouraged to participate. If you sell four cases, you get the Friday before spring break off as an excused absence. Forms must be picked up in the student services beginning on 2 2 Today's birthdays are Brody Belanger, Gerquillen Robinson, Zach Lawson, and Kale Moss. Happy birthday, guys. That's all for Tuesday. Have, Have a great, great day, Panthers.